Geek Journal. Ah, oh, yes. Geek Journals. Very nice. What was I going to say? I was going to say Gig Journal. Oh, baby, baby. Storms rolling in. Some family rolled in last night from Florida. Two o'clock in the morning. We were up at 6.30. So, uh, not much sleep today. But, I did find a magic cream for chicken neck. Chicken neck. Chicken neck. Perhaps visiting the chicken coop. You know, maybe it's just cause he's just too old, you know? I mean, he, he, he's got some years, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ah, chicken neck makes very, 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 very good soup. Oh. Beep, 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 beep. That's the, uh, so I've got a lot of junk over there in the passenger seat. It's expecting a person there and the seat belt isn't fastened, so it beeps at me for 15, well, a minute. So, uh, Saturday morning, 8.20, and we are headed to a farmer's market, Cotswold Farmer's Market, and the uh, weather forecast is dreary. Rain, drizzle right now, cloudy, cold, it's like 59 degrees outside. I, it's this is Memorial uh, Weekend. Oh, excuse me. And I've got uh, a flannel shirt on. You know, so a couple new tunes today. I was thinking of doing "Don't Be Cruel," the Elvis Presley tune. Kind of a little rockabilly swing. Uh, I didn't play Till There Was You last time. I might do that. And A Taste of Honey I was noodling with the other day. I don't know what else we got in store. You think you could be a little more pacific? I mean, maybe I mean pacific. pacific. Now, the other thing to note, too, is that this is... On this leg of the Mr. Vague World Tour... It's another double header today. So, um, got this gig from 9.30 to 12 at the farmer's market. I'll come home, rest up, eat some grub. Ah, now, did he say corn dog? Uh, where can I find me one of them? Where can I find me a corn dog? I'm hungry. I'm getting hungry too. All this talk about ham and cheese. Oh. Uh, I'm hungry too. And then I think there's another gig, a private party gig with the full band tonight, the Water's Edge Band. Fantastic band, by the way. And that is a private party down the road a ways from I think six to eight, six to eight thirty. I'm not sure of the time, but and uh, hang on here. And that'll be. Uh, swinging into action tonight, so with the electric guitar with the Surf Green Telecaster I happen to love Surf Green which is a fantastic video Mr. Vague YouTube featuring Professor Surf Green and what else? I think that's it so I rehearsed a little for this for this uh, farmer's market show, you know, got to keep the acoustic guitar chops, pork chops, ham hocks, got to keep them in tune. And uh, I did a little rehearsing on the electric guitar the other day for the gig tonight. Just some noodling on some lead parts and things. 
All right, uh, I'm gonna, <laughs> before I drive off the road, like I said, we don't advise driving and filming or recording video while driving around turns or at high speed or any, you know, not even while you're cutting the grass, mowing the lawn, you know? Um, oh, shut up. Ah, shut up. Ah, shut up. I don't know what all was in his Kool-Aid this morning, but... Now, and the other thing, um, you know, last, last, uh, almost like two weeks ago at the farmer's market, when I was having some issues with what I thought was a bad cable, you know, my acoustic guitar, the, the Guild D50 was cutting out. <clears throat> What's going on back there? Something going on back there. And the Guild D50 was cutting out. Uh, I thought it was either a problem with the amp, you know, the tubes or something, or the rain, you know, got a little got a little wet in there. I did some uh, experimentation this uh, this week, and what we found was it was the dang little nine volt battery in the Guild D50s. Uh, you know, saddle pickup gizmo. I think it's a Fishman Natural One. Um, I poked around there a couple times and I couldn't find where it was. I looked online and it's a, it's in a little canvas or a little like, you know, material nine volt battery holder that's Velcroed onto the guitar wall in there. Oh, sorry. Something beeped at me. So, uh, put a new battery in and wango jango. It worked, so, um, you know, I don't even know if I had a, you know, nine volt battery with me that day. There was so much confusion with the weather and trying not to get equipment wet. I hope I don't have the same problem today. I, I was thinking they were going to cancel this market today. Um, but yeah, plan B, keep an extra nine volt or around never know when you're going, you know, especially if you're playing acoustic guitars with preamps in them, okay? And if I, you know, yeah, I was going to say I could have mic'd, I had an amp, I could have mic'd, um, well, I, yeah, I had an SM57 mic, I could have mic'd my acoustic guitar directly, but I didn't have a mic stand. I could have duct taped something up and mic'd it to the board. Um, you know, there's, there's always other things to do. But I just wound up playing the other, the second guitar that I had, the Ep Epi, um, and doing an all electric show. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, we'll talk later. I don't know how much time I'm going to have. Like I said, my filming crew, they're on vacation. You know, the boys, they're all sleeping, you know, back in bed while. See ya. Uh, why don't y'all just wake me up when it's over? Oh. Yeah, we're doing a quick walk through here. We've got the Bose L1 Compact. There's the Guild with a new battery. Um, Guild D50 case. There's the XU Yami. Uh, our mic stand. And our Van Hassen music stand. Our pedalies. And I actually have. And there's the uh, JT22 mic. And the Epi is in back inside. And some cheese curls. And that's the basic setup right now. In any case, I'm glad things worked out good at the gig. I'm sure Mr. Veg, I wasn't there, but I'm sure Mr. Veg had a swell time and entertained everyone to the fullest. <laughs> Now you 
can subscribe by clicking that little that little subscribe button in the corner. What's your problem?